Are one shot lectures really useless or there is a secret that toppers doesn't want you to know Students from past few days I see a lot of videos selling stop watching one shot lectures for JE and NEET preparation and students are actually confused So a small trick can actually change your game so stop scrolling for one second because I am going to shock Hello students I am Ms Gopika your own biology master teacher on Vini Tamil Nadu So in the video lo oru velli velli confusion we are going to reduce Ore side la everyone is saying that stop watching one shot lectures and in our side like toppers are swearing by watching one shot lectures yes so today in this video we are going to decode it now actually is one shot lectures useless the answer to that question is no because one shot lectures are a detailed version of your chapter just imagine you are opening a random chapter and you have no idea all that you see is confusion huge numericals formulas a lot of flow charts and diagrams but at the same time imagine you are watching a one shot lecture of a teacher she would teach you in such a beautiful way that the entire ncert will be in that lecture with the help of smart notes so one shot lectures are not useless but instead we should know how to exactly utilize it toppers use one shot lectures before the exam for quick revision toppers also use one shot lectures before they are going to write a full test so wait i will tell you in 2 minutes first of all one shot lectures do not replace your whole study routine instead they give you super clarity that is number topper says that if you have already read the chapter once then one shot lectures are the magic lens yes you heard me right once you read your ncert if you kind of understand it then if you watch a one shot lecture with detailed explanation that will make your foundation very strong and after that if you do question practice you are sorted and what is the best part at the end of the exam you will never have stress so extra lecture saves your time from confusion opening the book just going through ncert not understanding is so much difficult so instead use one shot lectures now second question that comes ma'am is one shot lectures really enough for neat 2026 and 2027 listen toppers have scored 650 plus by just using youtube one shot lectures and pyq practice so why do you think it's actually waste of time it is a way how you revise some chapters before the last week of examination or during your preparation ma'am can i watch one shot lectures right now Yes students the answer to that is one shot lectures yes but what kind of one shot lectures you shouldn't be watching lectures which are 30 minutes or one hour which are concise instead you should watch detailed lectures that explain every single line of ncert additional points and also tells you which are the concept for that you can also check out my biology lectures on vini tamil nadu because everything has detail of it now last minute you're confused what am i supposed to do before the examination or before a full test that time also your shortcut is going to be one shot lectures so some influencers or some of them might motivate you telling that one shot lectures are a waste of time but the truth is it's not because stoppers have yet again proved that one shot lectures help them now here's something that is very shocking some students actually completely avoid one shot lectures thinking that it is useless and waste of time and they will lose marks if they don't watch a detailed lecture or part by part lectures but students don't you think that part by part lectures are all consigned together into one lecture now ma'am is only one shot lectures enough let me answer that question for all of you you can watch one shot lectures but if after watching one shot lectures you're not reading ncert that means you're missing out on a lot so i would say that watch them strategically revise smartly and you can reduce your stress but students after watching one shot lecture make sure that you have understood all the concept utilize that concept into pyq practice or into practicing high level questions and also use test series during this time because now that you have watched the lecture now it is the time to analyze yourself and understand how much have you understood so that time you should use test series and that test series should be really precise according to the need 2025 pattern and as i told you before also if you want test series do let me know in the comment section just put test series and i will be giving you a big big surprise now the fact that one shot lectures are not waste of time is right now understood by all of you but how do toppers exactly use it is the next question after watching one shot lecture reading ncert is something that all of you would do now the third thing is students you should also read the summary and the authors thing especially when it comes to biology because in need 2025 we noticed that lot of questions came from the authors part after doing this to solve pyqs because sometime what happened when we are watching a lecture every single concept is super clear in our head but the moment it comes to question we get stuck 
so for that you have to practice ample amount of questions to really understand what is exactly going wrong now let's say you're getting stuck in a concept that time you can definitely search a 10 minutes or a 15 minutes video that explains only that concept or an animated video to understand that concept clearly but never waste your time thinking that i should always watch a part lecture or i should not watch one shot lecture because someone told me or someone motivated me from stop watching it it's not true when so much resources are there you should know how to use the resources i hope this video gives you a clarity on if one shot lectures are useless or not because this has been lately a big discussion out there and students keep texting me about this because i have also started one shot lectures on the channel and trust me every single one shot lecture is curated in such a way that it has additional information it also has some related topics that will be connected to your mbbs first year as well anatomically especially human physiology topics have been done very detailedly so check out the lecture students and if you're new to weenie tamil nadu do not forget to subscribe to the channel